Meat and Cass and Bobby like that? Mm, so good. Crazy bastard bashing it in with a rock. We at the hotel, motel, holiday inn. Where's Pitbull? Ooh, Clem got a soccer ball. I gotta say soccer ball because most of my audience is actually American. It's football. Precision control. Don't you smile. You don't do that. Oh, there we go. Smile's gone. Is she going to be like Andrea and shoot me in the face? Oh god, she's exactly like Andrew. She's gonna shoot me in the face. Oh. <laughs> Clem's making her anxious. The size of your man's forehead. Jesus. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit. What the hell are they doing? Come on, come on! Oh what happened? Oh, I'm okay, Clem. We found Bobby. Wanna be Bobby. Ew, what kind of face was that? And you can't pull derp faces. And I thought we could save his life. I thought we could save his life. I'm the one that took his leg. That makes me responsible. Well, that was a stupid thing to do. We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group, right here, right now. Well, hang on. <laughs> hey, it's, it's my wife. Yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Yeah, they can. I, I believe everything so you say, I'll do anything you say. To survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The Give her hell, Cass. Because you had food. Enough for all of us. That food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, Aww. You like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. It's a dictatorship. Oh, come on. You're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not going to be a part of that. Oh, why? I didn't ask. Damn it. She's work. gone. No, I've no bloody fun. The food when there was enough to go around. It doesn't matter who's in charge because I'm in charge. Goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Most people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. Kenny, I will fuck you up! I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. So she's got five balls. The wall. That might be a problem for the doctor there, and you just said that openly. She seems okay with that. I'm a little bit scared. For me. I'm a little bit mean. scared. I'm the one that rations the food, but nobody else wants to. No, we hate you because you're a bitch. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Four food items for t oh shit. Oh God! <laughs> what? Oh. All right, Katja. Let's see what you're doing over here. I don't know. Can you give me a hand, real quick? Sure. Sure, what you need. Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But 
I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Blade, this man has no leg. What? That's how I found him. But I did the right did thing. The right thing. Aw, oh, thanks, Katya. You're always on my side. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. No problem, girlfriend. I need a little space here anyway. Alright, I suppose we'll go check on uh good old cat ooh, what's this? It keeps the walkers out. Carly's been doing the bulk of the lookout duty. Yeah, I've been doing a bit of lookout on my own, you know what I'm saying? Alright, Cass, what's up? Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got sixty cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. How rude! Misha thinks you're an asshole! You holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there. Having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, I just hope Kadja can save him. So, Lily is pretty pissed. Pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but... But nothing! God she damn it, we're having a conversation here! Those parasites you guys brought back need to go! I cannot get over the size of your forehead. It is massive. You ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. No, I didn't! Completely overrun. Ah, okay. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Ah. Uh... I'm always giving it away, but I'm going to give it to Mark, because Larry, you're kind of mean. Yeah, well, help. Here you go, Mark. I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Oh, God! You snitch! He... Oh, I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cranky. You know what, Larry, for a grumpy old bastard, I like you. So I'm going to give you something. But first, uh, let's see. Lily and Kenny need to get along. You've got They're breaking up the family. Along with Kenny. Lily can make her own friends. It's not about making friends. We're all in this together. we got to start acting like it. Uh, stuff all that. We'd be fine without you. Oh, no need to sweet talk me. Lily wants to dish to new people. Damn right. There's too many people hanging around here as it is. You want some food? Here, Larry. Here. Have a cracker and cheese. Want you to keep your strength up. Because you're a cracker. about me so much. Oh, man. Just seeing the food is driving me crazy. Ah, uh, sorry, Cass. I already have the rest. To give out to two other people, that is pretty obvious. Can I kick the ball? At least the kids have something to keep them occupied. You should give them a gun. You gotta train them. How you doing, Clement? Hey, Clem. Where's your hat? I don't yeah, know. I was just about to say it. Help me find it. Sure. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. What happened, Duck? How you doing, Duck? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog? Nope. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? No. <laughs> you goddamn idiots. You're a pretty brave we kid. Brave when we brought those people in here. That's because I know mom can fix him. Oh, well, you jinxed it now. Bobby's dead. You want some food? How about a little food? Oh, he's all excited. <laughs> Bobbing along. Here's some crackers, you crazy kid. Yeah. Oh, man, I'm so hungry. Yeah, I take care of the kids. Oh, Garly looks so upset. 
Uh, first, I gotta check on Ben. Is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. So, how you holding up? How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, um... I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of... I don't know. Something. You'll be prepared next time. You'll be prepared next time. Next time? Yeah. You're a vigilante in the making, Ben. So who are you? Who are you people? Our group's gonna wanna know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when... when everything happened. When shit hit the fan, Ben, you can see it. Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. Now to feed the most important girl in the group. How you doing, darling? Now, what to ask? Uh, you still have that walkie-talkie? That thing doesn't work anymore, does it? No, not since it broke at the drugstore. Just gonna hold on to it then? Yeah, if that's okay. I, um, I need it. That's fine. That's okay, hon. You said they'd find us. I know, I did. And until then... Look, uh, Clementine. Oh. Stupid, oh. I Whoa. Know it's just pretend, but it makes me feel better. Okay, you take good care of it then. Got hostile all of a sudden. Gotta cheer her up. How Are you, you doing, doing okay? Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? He'll be fine. He'll be, fine. He'll be dead in a couple of minutes That's anyway. It. I'm so hungry, Lee. I hope I get to eat soon. Well, have no fear because Lee is here. Hey, Clem, you need something to eat. Now, what is left? We'll give her half an apple. I love apples. Thank you. Are there more? No, honey. That was the last one. Oh, um. Enjoy it. You deserve it. All right, it's pretty obvious I gotta go Paragon with this one. Gotta save the piece of jerky for somebody else. Damn straight. And it's pretty obvious who I'm going to give it to. Carly, we have not talked in a very, very long time. I'm giving out the food. What should I do? Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not. You know it could be an easy job, huh? What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food. You know that guy can be a real dick sometimes. All the time, man, but I did it. Food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you if he decides to take off in that RV one day. Did that too? What about you? You need food too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. Ah. Isn't she lovely? Are you sleeping any better? Cause I can help. No, I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. That's a damn shame. Yeah. Oh, because what's his face died? Yeah. Uh, want some food? Want something to eat? Last piece of jerky. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. Whoa. When was the last time you ate? Oh, because I okay. didn't eat. Okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. I love you! I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Holy crap, look at the crazy bye. bastard in the back! Alright, bye, Carly. No, but seriously, he looks like he's gonna kill someone. Kenny, gonna have to sort you out, buddy. Gonna calm you down. <laughs> 